36, 37, 37. 37. 37. 37. 37. Yeah, 37 inch, so Gentlemen, this is Conor, your YouTube fisherman, back here at surf fishing. I know it's been a while, I've been away for a month and I did some uh, kayak fishing, couple of them, but I miss my surf fishing, guys. It's nothing like surf fishing, but the problem is summer. We're in Florida, it gets hot. I mean, I'm talking scorching hot. The heat index last week when I was kayak fishing was 115. 115 degrees so today it shows 105 uh it's gonna feel like 105 it's gonna be hot so i'm gonna be telling you guys how to fish during the summer in florida on these hot days i'm gonna give you a couple tips and tricks obviously the first one the obvious one you gotta come here early before sunrise sun is about to come up beautiful gorgeous morning that's the one key element you have to be here before the first light set up get ready and then in the morning you gotta wait for the incoming tide so the high tide today is around 9 a.m which is perfect it's 6 30 a.m right now and we're gonna catch the incoming tide high tide we're gonna use our lures when it comes closer and hopefully catch some good fish but in the meantime, we're gonna throw out live shrimp and fish gums. I have the green chartreuse color. Same thing over there. This one I cut the head off of the shrimp and I put the fish gum or fish bites so that way the shrimp stays. I also have this string. This comes handy, guys. I use the string, I tie the shrimp so it stays on the hook longer. That's a good trick as well. I would suggest you guys buy that. All these products, all my stuff that I use, it's on the description below. You guys can take a look at it, take advantage of it. I do get a little bit of commission from Amazon, so I appreciate you guys checking it down below. But look at this, guys. Sun is coming out. What an incredible view. But I love this. This is the best time of the day to fish. Early in the morning. All right, the first rod is out. Shrimp and fish comes around 50 yards, 60 yards. And of course, we're gonna use our uh, jigging as well. Nice paddle tail. We tied them out with the 20 pound braid and 20 pound mono. Got my 5000 Shimano and we're just gonna work the pockets right here. I see the bait and let's see what happens and we're gonna keep an eye on our other rod. Hopefully it bends. Nice pompano maybe, they're still around here and there. Definitely whiting, jacks, whatever bites guys. Look at this, how beautiful. Oh my God. This is so nice. Sun is coming out. It's already 85 degrees, if you can believe it. <laughs> it's gonna be a hot day. But that's why we came early. I draw almost two hours. But hopefully, it's worth it. Let's see what we catch. Well guys, the seaweed and slime still here. I'm more south from where I usually go and look at this. That's the worst, the slime. Seaweed, I don't really mind much, but the slime is the worst for me. You can't really fish, you can't really do anything. Same thing goes with the lure as well. As soon as I cast, I get a slime, so. That's what happens on an incoming tide as well. It will clear up when it's outgoing tide. But we're here, we got a fish. <laughs> wow, we're gonna switch to a spoon. 
with the little bottom teaser, travel hook. The slime is ridiculous. So I'm just gonna toss it right there, the pocket right in front of us. I got the 20 pound fluorocarbon leader and hopefully we'll catch some Spanish Jack and I'll see if it gets better with the slime later on like it's crazy people were here they're leaving like every cast slime but hey I'm here I drove all the way here so <laughs> I'm definitely gonna catch fish before I go. Before it gets to 105 degrees. Yep. There's the seaweed and slime. Fish on. Is it? With the seaweed? <laughs> it's hard to tell with the seaweed, guys. It's crazy. It's so much seaweed and slime. I don't know if I have fish or not. Or the seaweed's dragging. But I think I have a fish with this line <laughs> let's see hopefully first fish of the day I see a huge slime something behind it oh my god look at that slime guys look at that slime nope wow this is what we're getting <laughs> what do you guys think time to relocate I think so Wow, ridiculous. Well, ladies and gentlemen, absolutely horrible conditions. Slime, seaweed, but slime is unbearable. There's no way. And people are leaving too. It's ridiculous. The only thing you catch right now is a shark week. You gotta definitely can catch a shark. Put a big bait, big chunk of um, frozen mullet, whatever. Uh, bait fish you will catch a, a nice shark for sure but I don't want to catch a shark I don't want to deal with it I know it's shark week but you know I don't like to catch him and waste time with him I don't keep him I don't eat him so I don't want to bother him you know that's just that's how I feel I want to catch good whiting today maybe if you got lucky pompano but it's impossible guys so I'm relocating I'm gonna see you on the new location I have to gather my thoughts regroup plan b i'll let you know what's up yes we have relocated ourselves sebastian inlet the good the bad and the ugly sometimes hot sometimes not but i'm here the surf fishing was unbelievable is unfishable ridiculous seaweed and slime seaweed like i said i don't mind too much but slime was unbearable and all i'm seeing is right now also incredible amount of seaweed very dirty that's crazy towards the middle a little better so i'm gonna try to cast out there use some paddle tails slam shady Fred, see what we could do. I might hit the surf side as well. I got my surf rod just to see, try. Maybe on this side is better, but I don't think so. But we gotta make the best of it, guys. Let's see how we do. You gotta catch a fish. We cannot get skunk. Stay tuned. <laughs> what? This is worse. Oh my God. Look how thick the seaweed and slime is here. Oh my goodness. Oh wow. Yeah, there's no way. No way. All right, plan C. 
Let's see what the plan C is, guys. Oh, man, I worked out this morning for sure, guys. Plan C, I'm on the north side of Sebastian Inlet. It looks much clearer, obviously. One side coming in, one side going out. Woo! Oh boy, definitely burned some calories this morning. But it looks better. I'm gonna try my luck here and then hit the North Jetty. Gotta catch something, guys. Gotta catch something. Let's do this. I found the best of both worlds. I'm gonna use the beach side, surf side by Sebastian. It's much better since the seaweed on the south. I came north and it's much clearer here. So I'm gonna go ahead and cast it here. Not too far. Make sure nobody's there. There you go. Shrimp and fish gum. Let it sit there. Perfect. And then I'm gonna work the other side with the gacha lure and jigs. Soap for some jack, snook, whatever bites. <laughs> Let's do it. Oh, it's a tank snook. That is a tank snook, guys. Wow, that's a good one. Get in there, buddy. Oh man, that's a good one. That's a big boy. There yeah. you go, oh, man. Oh yeah. Holy cow. Oh yeah, that's a big boy. And you got that with a 2500? Man, you the man. Look at that. Look how fat that thing is. Look at that. 36, 37, 37. 37. 37. 37. 37. 37. Yeah, I think it's so boys. fat. You mind taking a picture of me? Fat boy. <laughs> Good job, buddy. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Oh, wow. Hell yeah. <laughs> it's a monster. 37 inch oh, fat fish boy. on. Fish on, baby. What do we got? Spanish. Blue, <laughs> surf side baby. Oh, what is that? What is that? That's a blue runner. That is a blue runner. Oh yes. Oh man. They pull like a freight train. I got somebody else's line, of course. A little blue, right? Yeah, little blue runner. Guys, look at that. Big old snook just chilling there. <laughs> That's hilarious. Look, look, he's gonna toss in that big bait right in front of him. Oh, oh, you spooked it. That's crazy. Look, another one. Look, 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 he's going. Oh, spooked. <laughs> That's crazy. Let me see. All right, let's toss that. Ah, oh, he's not interested, man. Nope, he's not interested. Oh man, he's going out there. I caught him before with the gacha lure. He's not hungry, it's too hot. He'll feed early in the morning and later at night. Well guys, I got defeated by the heat. It's not even 12 o'clock. It's 105 heat index. Oh my God. And I gotta go to a wedding anyways, but I can't stand here anymore. Just a blue runner. I got a couple uh, black marguerite. Uh, another bait fish. I don't know what it was, but that's it. That person got that 37 inch fat snook. It was on a live shrimp split shot and he was using a 2500 reel it's crazy but good for him man he got it that's the only fish caught in the pier south north beach nobody caught anything guys nothing it's hot 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 but that's it for today we'll regroup oh my god it's hot guys we will regroup and do our kayak fishing 
we're gonna do what we love get out there early and do some redfish snook fishing i got a couple spots stay tuned for that oh wow it's hot again i appreciate it tuning in at least we didn't get skunk we didn't catch good fish but that's how it goes sometimes i try everything plan a plan b plan c even plan d on the other side of the jetty for the surf but that's it guys so i appreciate you tuning in i will see you on the next video tight lines <laughs>